Hope is back with another video. Today I wanted to go a little bit more in depth on the mixed species vivarium. Basically giving you guys some info about what lives in here and how they live in here. To start off, there's three American green tree frogs. They act as population control to make sure the bugs in here don't get out of control. They're ambush predators, meaning they wait for the bugs to come to them. They usually group up by the water dish, under the lights to bask, and even sleep by each other. If they do see an opportunity to eat, they're capable of jumping the entire length of the tank. Next, we got the Mediterranean house geckos. There's a pair in here now, but I think there's space for another female. As you'll see in a bit, they're the first species of reptiles to reproduce in the tank. This tail waving is a form of communication. Last, we got the anoles or the green anole, or the American chameleon. They're not chameleons, but are called that because of their ability to change shades of greens and browns to match their surroundings. The frogs and geckos can do this too. In fact, a lot of species of reptiles and amphibians can do this as a form of communication and camouflage. sure to maintain a stable population of mealworm beetles and crickets in the tank. That way the animals can hunt more naturally and forage for their food. As you can see here, there's a small colony of pavement ants that are also in the tank that help control populations as well. There's 
also a colony of Madagascan roaches, and that's just to add more variety and more foraging opportunities. The adults are too big to be eaten by anything, so they just keep having babies, and that basically feeds the tank. On top of the variety of bugs they can hunt within the tank, the lizards and geckos and frogs eat their own shed. gonna be just about it for this one I just want to show you guys the little ecosystem that I got going on I'll definitely keep you guys posted on the progress of this tank and how it does over time during the warmer summer months the lizards in here will start having babies so I'll definitely keep you guys posted on that however if you like the video definitely consider leaving a like and a sub it'll be much appreciated and as always thanks for watching